good. I'm good. Ice skating is so much harder than it looks. I know, right? Uh huh. Yeah, I've tried it. Today I might not be I'd the best day to try like, it at all. Woo! That's for sure. But it, what, it didn't, didn't work out that way. No. Um, and what I want you to do is if you're going to do something outside today, whether you're going to try ice skating or anything else, if you want to do it with temperatures in the 50s, do it now. Yeah. And like for the next four hours and then after that, the temperatures begin to fall because right by around sunset tonight, we're going to have temperatures down to 40. So it's a big drop in a short amount of time. It's going to be a pretty precipitous drop of temperatures. And then after that, we stay in the general 30 degree range. We may have one little day on Wednesday where temperatures get back up into the 40s, but no more 50s, at least anytime soon. Oh my goodness, it looks downright tropical out there, doesn't it? I actually see some sunshine and it gives the appearance of being a little bit warmer, which by the way, it is out there today. The sun has been up for a while. The days are now getting longer as opposed to shorter. Sunrise is now at 717. Sunset is at 426. And remember, by about then, we're going to have temperatures back down into the low 40s. The day length for today is 9 hours and 8 minutes. Temperatures are currently coming in at 53 degrees at Midway, 51 O'Hare. We've been here pretty much all day long. Temperatures really haven't budged much up or down. But look what happens. 1 o'clock, we're still in the same temperature range, but we're in the mid 40s by 3 by 5 we're down to 40 by 7 we're down to 35 and then we're down to 30 degrees by 11 o'clock. Usually this kind of drop off happens a little bit uh, later in the day but not today. Uh, today it's going to happen a little bit earlier so we begin to see that influx of some cooler air coming into the picture. Had some rain earlier across Ben Newton, Jasper and LaPorte counties in Indiana. We still do have a little bit of light shower activity. Rest of the area though is looking dry and a bit calmer. Still dealing with some snow up across the northern tier states here around International Falls and down to Minneapolis, but it's certainly not heavy accumulating snow at this point. However, they still have blizzard warnings up, and that's because of the fact that the blowing and drifting is a big feature. You can also still see wind advisories in the brownish uh, kind of tan shaded color there, a possibility of some ice and some snow up across northern parts of Minnesota. So still de dealing with very winter-like weather across the middle of the nation there in the northern plains. For today, you're going to see an early shower. That's pretty much over for most of us. Breezy, warm, and the sunshine starts to come out. 53 degrees the high, but very gusty. We're talking 40 mile an hour gusts out there. That continues through tonight. But by tonight, that wind is ushering in colder air. We're talking about breezy conditions and getting down to about 26 degrees. Your uh, forecast for tomorrow calling for the 30s again. Mostly sunny, still quite breezy out there. It's going to be that way here for the next couple of days. We're up to about 44 on Wednesday and then we settle back in in the 30s Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. I don't see any monumental snowstorms or systems that are going to come through at least as it looks right now. So it's a pretty calm week. Last week of 2016 started 2017. All right. Weather wise at least. <laughs> I don't know about the rest don't of it. Don't jinx it. it. I know. Thanks, Megan. <laughs> okay. And the final